Okay, guys, I'll be escorting them across. I'm assuming something's gonna happen. There. That, as much as your cock's a tent pole, hide, you blind fool. I guess a wild boar wanted me to kill it. That's fine. Tell me, are bears often boar shaped in your experience? Got weak eyes, see? Besides, I'm a fire eater, not some damn naturalist. Indeed, you are not, Master. Uh, believe I failed to ask. What do they call you? David Altonsborough. Listen here, Master Hattonsborough. Stay close, and no harm will come to you. I'll see to it your drunken, fire spitting gob gets to the wedding safe and sound. The missing fire blower is missing no more. It was my doing, if I may say so myself. And Demon? What's with him? He failed to return? No, he did. He's just acting mighty strange. Seems to be in a muddle of sorts. Got as much life in him as a carrot. Might have eaten some nightshade or whatnot. Your attention, please! I invite all to witness the spectacle unrivaled. A man so bold as to eat fire! We must watch the trickery. Never saw anything like it while alive. Uh, woo! Kicking ass, taking names. So now we got a bunch more to go through. This is actually, actually, I'm enjoying this a lot. Uh, my first Witcher contract done. Fire Eater found, his ass saved. If I could live again, I'd be a Witcher for damn certain. So let's go check out the next guest. Well, that's not a real guest. So let's go check out the next quest, I guess. Oh, hey, ladies. Hey, ladies, how you doing? All right, toasting the newlyweds. That's cool. That's cool. Let's. No, I don't want to extinguish. Drink, drink. Come on. Drink with us. I never say no to a lady, to your fair beauty, and to your shiny naturally. Your elf and happiness. Fortune smile upon you, white wolf. All right, pretty ladies. I'm gonna have to leave you for now. We're gonna go up here and take a look at as I walk through the flowers. Don't mind me and the flowers. Of all these flowers, you, my dear, are the loveliest. Believe the young man's mistaken me for another. Not at all. I like my women as I like my peaches. Fuzzy and well ripe. That's enough. Get going. You're drunk and randy. Nothing good's ever come of that mix. There's lots of good things that come from that mix. All right, come on. Look there, Shani. The ladder begs us to scamper to its top, where we can converse. Uh, then let us in. Uh, how so? Just like that? There aren't that many. What a wonderful wedding! All right, what are we looking at? Let's see. Come now. Just like that. Oh, I'm all ears. What would you have us talk about? I I'm sorry, converse about. Well, when it comes right down to it. Yes? You see, the thing is. Come now, spit it out. Mm, I. <laughs> yes, just as I thought. Come, it's time we return. He's kept his word so far. I'm impressed. Just as you thought. I what sport is this? 
blustering about after pigs, are you? Lads are racing to be crowned King of the Swineherds and win the prize that comes with it for their wench. Um, lady, maybe. And the rules? One must be a swineherd's son to enter, I suppose? Nay, any man can try his luck. All you need is to herd the piggies dabbed in yellow into the pen. King of the swineherds, eh? And what's this king get exactly? The king's ransom, I would hope. No coin. Honor's the prize. King gets a crown of laurels he pins to his saddle, rides about with pride that he's king of the swineherds. You mentioned some trifles for the lasses. Are they worthwhile at least? For certain! Lovely, every last one. Pretty as a painting. Win and see for yourself. Alright, let's do it. Sounds like damned foolish nonsense. But why not give it a try? We'd be honored. Get that cripple out of there! Could chase his own wench into a bed, let alone a pig into a pen. Let the witcher give it a run. I wonder if I can just do the sign on him. All right, so Shame there's no let us. Here. It's a moment worth immortalizing for posterity. All right. Watch my movement, Shani. I'm spry as a cat and sly as a fox. In the yellow, they sure say yellow, but I'm not sure where I see the yellow. Oh, you have to come into this one. Oh, that's what is that? What it is? Come on, there we go. Feel foolish, peasants. Learned a lesson from your better? Are the pigs penned? Indeed they are. Whoa, Master Witcher. What were the trickery back there, the fancy finger twisted? I know. Seen that afore. Witcher told a lad to go hang himself, drew some flowers in the air with his hand, and the man lost his mind. Meaning you cheated and shan't be crowned King of the Swineherds. Shani, what is it Geralt says in these situations? Damn it. <laughs> yes, that's it. Damn it. Now for what I say. Go shove rakes up your asses, you peasant curs. Do I look anything like a swineherd? Come, Shani. I've had enough of these hayseeds. Forgive me, Shani. I've let you down. Uh, are you worried about that pig? Oh, you needn't be. We're here as a couple. I wanted to win you that... that thing. Oh, really? It's unimportant. Nothing at all. Hmm. Tell me, Shani. What's the key with you? What do you mean? I'm on the prowl. That's clear. In Geralt's name and flesh, of course. But still... Yet the more I woo you, the less you seem ready to succumb. So I ask myself, what am I missing? Mm, perhaps you're just not my type. Considered that? Rubbish. I'm every lass's type. Is that so? Prove it. With pleasure. Show me a lass, and I'll have her eating out of my hand in the blink of an eye. Uh, that one, with the garland. Splendid choice. Now observe as Vladimir von Everek does his thing. Now, who have we here? Do I know you? That's the crux of it. We've not met. I've had to endure half a lifetime without you. <laughs> An entire lifetime, more like. A moment, my dear. Do not sabotage me, Shani. That would not be fair. <laughs> fine, fine. I'll stay out of your way. <laughs> My sweet, you are no mere maid, but a marvel of nature. And now, at last, fate knocks at your door. But I, well... Don't know rightly. You needn't know anything. I know it all for us both. I shall make a true lady of you. Arm in arm, we'll grace the finest salons. Salons? But really? 
at your salons in Novigrad. And how... <laughs> in Novigrad, Oxenfurt, why, in Kovir as well. Wherever you wish. Let's make haste to the barn. There, everything will be made clear. Leslie, step away from the man. Who the devils are you? We're the Mrs. Brothers, and we swore to our down his dying day we'd keep those of your ilk far from her. Easy, lads. No harm done. An innocent conversation with an innocent miss. The kind weddings are for. We all heard your innocent talk. Wanted to draw her to the barn. What were you gonna do there? Talk some more? Naturally. We would speak. But first, we would dance. Now tell me, what sort of fool wouldn't want to dance with a beauty like her? Find another beauty, or I'll dance with you myself. Just after I grab me a fence post. Geralt, you saw it. I tried to resolve this peacefully, but they wish to fight. Suits me just fine. Sounds like wonderful fun. Fence boards right over there for the taking. Fear eat your stones. That's the last plowing straw. No one accuses Vladimir von Everick of cowardice. Calm down, boys. Don't want to fight you. Too damn bad, because we're going to tan your mutant freak hide. That does it! Show us what you got. Hot damn, boy. You needn't ask me twice. Ho ho ho! Here we go, here we go. Fence boards, the perfect weapon for sweaty ass swiners. Wow, they're 33rd level. Damn. Yo, you plowing gentle fuck. Never in my life have I reveled so fiercely. Step up. Who else wants a shave? Had enough peasant spawn? Thought yourself a match for a Von Ever? I mean, a witcher? Away with you. Be gone. I've tired of looking at your slack jaw yaps. Where to, my love? I was to turn you into a lady. Don't. You must explain I was not at fault. They lunged at me. Well, go on, chase her. In your dreams. There it is. You fucked up. She's gone. Is that how you woo the ladies? You always that charming in life? It worked. More often than not. Listen. Tongue and fists on a leash from now on. Have your fun, but don't beat the wedding guests. With my hands. Fine. I shall try. Uh-oh. Shani approaches. Unlikely to be happy, eh? You made this mess. You do the explaining. Oh. All right. <sighs> your methods... Quite unusual. To woo a woman by beating up her brothers. Creative. Wonder what else you have up your sleeve. I can demonstrate if you like. My dear girl, what don't I have up my sleeve? I'd gladly demonstrate. Perhaps behind the barn? Uh, I think you've demonstrated enough. Let's just enjoy ourselves, all right? You don't have all that much time left. Your wish is my command, milady. I'd never deny a maid so fair-featured. Off we go. Ah, my kind of tune. Let's do some dancing. <laughs> In my experience, witches and dancing don't exactly mix. Today they mix like fire and oil, my love. We'll dance the barn down. Faster, faster, till we expire.
And now, a special treat for our special guests. The Witcher Geralt and his enchanting partner, Shani. Musicians, something lovely for the loving couple. At last, music for our loving embrace. Come, Shani. It's time you discovered my romantic side. Good at this. A chair could dance a jig with you as its partner. Oh, how humble you are. I strive to be. Yet should the need arise, I can strut as proud as any peacock. Oh, the perfect combination. Women must love you. Well, not to brag, but... Call it idle curiosity, but how many have you had? Many. And not a scrub hag among them, I should add. Women with true class, all. Though none to match your charms. Seems the music in the evening draw to a close. Know how a true dancer thanks his lovely partner? Um, not sure I do. What are you doing? Have you lost your mind? I have my mind, my heart, for you. We must agree. You can say whatever you please, but you shall keep your hands to yourself. Understood? Don't be upset, my peach. I couldn't resist. I'm not upset. Just... Next time, don't lunge at me like that. I'd had a long fast, so to speak. Hunger overwhelmed me. But yes, next time, I shall ask. Shani, may I kiss you? <laughs> you are incorrigible. Could I talk to Geralt for a moment? What for? He'll have nothing of interest to say. The man's a drip. Please. <sighs> Very well. See how I've reeled her in? Now don't fuck this up. Geralt, I'm curious what it's like when that ghost's inside you. Do you feel anything? Have any control? I feel everything. Don't have any control over what I do or say, though. Why do you ask? Because I wonder what it would have been like to dance with you. Just you. Well, I probably wouldn't have forced myself on you. Forced myself? It was an innocent kiss, not more. <laughs> I don't know if I should thank you or if that should make me angry but don't get me wrong i've thought about doing just that a few times but but what but i'm not going to talk about it with him here we can discuss it once he's gone <laughs> i'll hold you to that perhaps a bit of thanks is in order seems i've snared the little robin for you you can shut up now what's going on now nothing never mind happen to see the man who announced our your song yes he acted as though he knew me, but we've never met. I was surprised. Who is he? Gontor Odin, Master Mirror. Wonder what he's doing here. Then perhaps you should just ask him. Yeah, he didn't show up without a reason. Need to talk to him. Consider that he might have simply been nearby and dropped it on a whim. Promise you this much, he never does anything simply. And certainly not on a whim. Bah. I was to make merry, carouse. Yet here I've stood the last five minutes, listening to you talk. I'm going back in. Ah, better. Come, Shani. The night beckons us not to jabber it away.
All right, we should talk to Master Mirror. Let's do something wild. So first of all, let's go find Master Mirror. I think that's going to be the more important thing first. Hey, Gonser. But gingerbread's now but flour, honey, eggs, and spices. I beg to differ, madame. You omit the most important ingredient in gingerbread. Time. What sort of balderdash is he feeding them? Quiet. If you listen, you'll learn. Time? What do you mean, time? An ingredient? Time gives the proper consistency. Time provides that ideal crunch on the outside, the delicious moistness within. So how much of this time does it take? That you will not find in any recipe. You must surrender to your senses. Let them lead you so close to time, you touch it. Let you sniff it, stroke it even. Time. Time is the key. Greetings, Shani. I must introduce myself. Gaunter Odin. My, what a lovely dress. The color suits you exquisitely. Thanks. I've heard a lot about you, but no one mentioned cooking. Seem to know quite a bit about gingerbread. Quite simply, I know a lot about everything. Is that so? What do you know about me? That you were ever the worst brother, that you envied all gear from your earliest days, and always wished to be just like him. Wait, you can see me? That is, me, Vladimir von Everek? Of course. Why ever wouldn't I? Because I'm in Geralt's body, the Witcher's, and... Just who would I be if the true nature of things remained hidden from me? Someone like you, meaning no one. I wouldn't want to get blood on my damsel's dress. But insult me once more and... You shan't touch me. I know you'd very much like to act like your brother in this situation. Demonstrate how manly you are, but... Let's be honest. Nothing will come of it. You're simply not him, no matter how much you wish you were. Rubbish. I never envied my brother. Of course you did. He was a shining role model. Olgierd ran faster, shot truer, lifted greater weights. Olgierd learned to read first, although you tried your damnedest to beat him. As you grew up, he had his pick of girls, whereas you made do with the leftovers. I apologize, Shani. I'm rather sorry you have to hear this. Stop fooling yourself. Shani isn't here for you. She's here for Geralt. Even after death, you still play the pale imitation. Oh, by the way, Olgierd's a much better dancer. You lying dog. That's my brother. I loved him. The question is, were you as dear to him as he seems to have been to you? He made a hero of me in death. In my last battle, in truth, I was far from valiant. Five came at me. I'll not deny it. I fled. I hid in a cellar, yet they found me, cornered me like a rat. But Olgierd told everyone I flew at all five, took them on all at once, alone. I'm rather curious how you know all this. Olgierd visits my grave, often, pours a drink for me, gets soused himself, and talks of the old times. He cannot see me, but I hear his every word. Hmm. Well. Perhaps one day he'll say something very surprising. What are you getting at? I shan't disturb you any longer. Have a splendid time, for time is... time is short. Shani, I'm sorry, I... It's all right. That was... Oh, forget him. We're here to enjoy ourselves, right? Let's go. The night's still young. All 
lies, not a word of truth. Don't let it bother you. Ungird was not just my brother. More importantly, he was my best mate. Let it go. I believe you. And now Revelon. Time won't wait. 